Welcome to the Perform Workflow video series. This video will demonstrate how you can optimize production from a well with multiple producing zones and will focus on the step-by-step -step process for creating a successful model for such wells using Perform. With the rising price of oil and gas, many companies are considering deepening their existing wells to produce from formations that were previously considered uneconomical. With Perform, Engineers can easily set up models for multi-layered or multilateral wells to determine the potential production benefits from these wells. They can find answers to questions like, how much extra production will we get by opening another zone? Or, if we drill another horizontal lateral, would that really help us to boost production? In order to demonstrate this workflow, we will be using one of the example analyses provided with Perform. First, click File, and then Open, and then navigate to the folder where Perform is installed. In the Example folder, open the file named SmartWell. Then, click on the Easy Interface to bring up the interactive wellbore diagram. In this example, we are modeling a three-layered reservoir, with the first layer already producing, and the bottom two are proposed to be drilled with horizontal configurations. Separate fluid, completions, and IPR models can be used for each layer to accurately recreate real-world scenarios. To begin with, we need to make sure that fluid, reservoir, and wellbore information are available. Before entering any of this information into PERFORM, it is a good idea to have a schematic of the well available with the correct formation depths shown. This will help us to model such wells without any hassle. First, click the Setup button on the top toolbar. Here, you can change the analysis type, fluid type, or flow direction, but notice the checked box that says Downhole Network. Perform can handle either multi-layered or multilateral wells, including any potential cross-flow. This gives you the flexibility to model even the most complex downhole networks with ease. Click OK to exit the setup screen. Next, click the Fluid Data button on the top toolbar, and then the Multiple Reservoir Fluid Data tab to define the fluid parameters for each layer of the reservoir. Each layer can have up to five of its fluid parameters defined independently, including oil gravity, gas-liquid ratio, water cut, and the specific gravity of the water and gas. The rest of the fluid properties are carried over from the first reservoir. Click OK when finished, and then double-click on each reservoir to define its parameters. First, let's take a look at the top layer. We mentioned before that the top layer is already producing and that the productivity index is measured from this layer. We will use this index to represent the deliverability of this zone. To see an overview of the several different IPRs Perform can use to model horizontal wells, click on the smiley face icon. For the bottom two layers, we'll use the Joshi IPR for horizontal wells. This IPR can also help us to determine the optimum tunnel length necessary to maximize production by using a sensitivity analysis. Next, we will define the completion parameters for each layer. Double-click on the wellbore underneath any node to open the completions data screen. For the first layer, we will leave the completions type as open hole or not calculated since the productivity index already includes the completions pressure drop. Open the completions data screen for the second or third layer, and note that we are using the open perforations completion model. Finally, double-click on the two link icons to see and edit the downhole equipment connecting each layer. Now, let's have Perform generate some reports and graphs for us. Click the Calculate button to have Perform generate the reports and graphs. The system report provides a detailed breakdown of the producing scenario and solution points for all layers, both individually and combined. We can see that, at zero bottom hole pressure, our reservoir inflow rates are 1,935 barrels per day from the first layer, 1,479 barrels per day from the second layer, 979 barrels per day from the third layer, and 4,341 barrels per day for all three layers combined. The system graph shows inflow and outflow curves for all layers combined, while the inflow by reservoir graph shows a detailed breakdown of the pressure and flow rates for each layer individually. 
In this video, we used PERFORM to develop a model for a well with three producing zones to determine the potential production benefits of drilling the bottom two. PERFORM can handle even the most complex downhole networks, including cross-flow and wells with up to 10 different producing or injecting layers. It is also possible to model wells with different geometrical configurations commonly available in wells with multiple laterals. Two other example analyses, called trilateral and two layers, are excellent demonstrations of using PERFORM to model wells with different configurations. To see how PERFORM can help you to solve other common production optimization problems, watch the rest of the video series. To get your engineers access to one of the most powerful production optimization tools in the industry, backed by worldwide support and training, call us at 1-800-527 7756 extension 402 or email us at sales.psg at ihs.com